Hello friends, welcome to the Breaking News 247 channel, in this video I would like to send the highlights of the day, if there were ever a time to join us, it is now. Every contribution, however big or small, powers our journalism and sustains our future. Andy Murray bows out of Indian Wells in style against Alexander Zverev. UFC terminates Luis Pena's contract after learning of disturbing allegations surrounding domestic violence arrest. Andy Murray battled Alexander Zverev every step of the way but was ultimately unable to overcome the German third seed at the BNP Paribas Open in Indian Wells, falling 6-4, 7-6. The Scottish former world number one began the third round clash in fine form, racing away to an early break before Zverev was able to settle into his rhythm and narrowly take the first set. The second set began in similar fashion, with Murray again going up a break before allowing Zverev back into the match. Murray made the most of some uncharacteristic mistakes from Zverev to force a team wreck, but the 2020 US Open finalist was able to win the crucial points down the stretch to make it through to the fourth round. Zverev paid tribute to Murray's performance in his on-court interview after the match. He's the only one of the big four that I hadn't beaten yet, so I'm happy that I've done it today, he said. I always stayed in the match, even though I was down a break in both sets. I always knew I had a chance. Especially the second set I think was an extremely high level from both of us. It could have gone both ways. Obviously it was a fantastic match. I thought Andy played extremely well, maybe as well as he's played since the hip surgery. I hope he continues playing the same way, because tennis did miss him for a long time and I think it's good to have him back. The UFC has parted ways with lightweight fighter Luis Pena. On Saturday, Pena was arrested in Deerfield Beach, Florida, on misdemeanor charges of domestic violence and simple battery. He was booked at the Broward County Jail in Fort Lauderdale. Disturbing details about the incident were revealed when the full police report became available to the public. According to the arresting officer's report, Pena struck his girlfriend and another woman repeatedly with a closed fist. After learning the details about events surrounding the arrest, the UFC decided to terminate Pena's contract. The promotion released a statement about the situation. UFC is aware of the disturbing allegations concerning the recent arrest of Luis Pena. Mr. Pena has been open about his struggles with mental health and substance abuse issues and the organization has on multiple prior occasions attempted to help him get professional treatment. At this time, UFC believes MR. Pena needs to deal with the health and legal issues in front of him and consequently has informed Mr. Pena's management that his promotional agreement has been terminated. UFC President Dana Watt addressed the situation on Tuesday evening. This was a bad case and we knew that he had problems before that we were trying to help him with, White told MMA Junkie and other reporters at the Dana White's Contender Series 43 post-fight news conference. This is a pretty nasty one. I don't know if you guys read the police report, but yeah, this one had to happen. Pena is just one of a trio of fighters recently involved in similar situations. Something like that could happen to anybody, White responded when asked if UFC Hall of Famer John Jones, who was also recently arrested following an alleged domestic violence incident in Las Vegas, could see similar repercussions. MMA legend Chuck Little was also recently arrested and jailed for an alleged domestic violence incident, although he no longer has ties with the promotion aside from being inducted into its Hall of Fame. Pena competed under the UFC banner seven times, winning four of those bouts, after entering the promotion following the Ultimate Fighter 27 inches in 2018. Thank you for watching our videos, subscribe to our channel to get notifications when we post newest videos, thank you and goodbye.